can't pretend to care about this. Oh, uh, Sarah, it's not a train or anything, but can we talk? So seems to have gotten tired and fallen asleep. I can only talk now while he's resting, so... Don't tell me, did you learn something important? Uh, I'm sorry, it's nothing like that, I'm afraid. Come to think of it, I've never gotten, uh... I've never really gotten to have a calm talk with Kana before. Kana just wants to chat with us, basically. Fuck you. Sarah, wanna trade 20 tokens between you, me, and now? Sup? See, I decided with Reko that we'd trade 20 tokens each. But, you know, gotta cross this shaky bridge together. For instance, we could pass 20 tokens like this from me to Sarah. What? Yeah, from me to Sarah to like this. God damn it, there's arrows. I tried. Or the other way. This way we won't need to have extra trade partners in the, fr in the future, see? So they're daring to sh trade them like this instead of equal share. I don't know if that's how I'd phrase it, but you know. Let's do it. That's the, that's the ticket. <laughs> that's what she would say. Um, so how are we doing this trade? This way, we either get nows or recos. Come on, you got it, you know? Sarah, you can choose whichever direction you like. Yep, and if you don't want to trade, we'll do it ourselves, so don't worry about that. They're so nice. If you get 50 of someone's tokens, you can get their personal info. I w want to receive from Reko if we can. I'll give my tokens to now. Reko, please give me yours. Got it. Don't lose them, okay? Obtain 20 Reko tokens. Well, that's it for negotiations. Woof! It hurts me out. What's wrong, Gein? The two of us went into an attraction, but I couldn't quite protect him. All right, mister. You already said that you had really strong arms, and I don't appreciate this. Take care of the baby. <laughs> Fix his Sarah. I I'm okay, meow. Just a scratch, wolf. But you're bleeding. Oh, I can look it better, wolf. What nice to be- <laughs> What nice to have somewhere to care for wounds. Uh, would you like to go to- the metal medical office? The metal office. What do you want? Scram, wolf. But it wouldn't be good if the wound was left to fester. You've got no right to be worrying over me, melon soda lady. Meow. Medical treatment for participants is just part of my job, you see. Hmm. <laughs> can't exact. Can't. Fuck. <laughs> now I'm in my own head, fucking up. Hmm. <laughs> Can't exactly believe you that easy, easily. <laughs> or are you willing to take a vow, Sophelin? I vow that I will cause him no harm. I won't go back on my word. Mm. Can't trust her, woof. It, I'd be mad if she remodeled my body into some weird superhuman meow. Hey, that sounds kind of cool. You'll do it if you want it that much, meow. I won't force it upon you, but I definitely do think you should get treatment. What to do? Out burgers. I can't trust Sotlin. But I'll have you guide us to the medical office. <laughs> if there really is a medical office, then we can handle the treatment ourselves. Yes, if that's fine with you. Please follow me this way. Melon soda lady. This is the medical office. What's this place, meow? Does it lead outside? Woof. Ah, no, everything you see is outside is an image pr projected. It's not my fault. Projected on the glass cabinets. An image? Yes, currently we're displaying a soothing tropical scene. How do you like it? Ah, uh, you're right. It does feel nice. Feels like the AC is tuned just right for it, too. <laughs> How observant. I actually manage this room myself. It serves as a laboratory as well. Uh, so can we heal game? <laughs> Ah, uh, yes, the medical supplies are over here. What the fuck did you do? <laughs> Just this. Stop it. Sophelin is looking my way. Please take it easy. Bitch. KG is tending to Gein's wound. It's lighter than I thought. Does it hurt, Gein? It doesn't, but I want to have Big Sis Sarah heal it for me, meow. Well, now, got me in a sore spot. A wound like this should be fine. A wound like 
like this should be fine just being washed in water and bandaged. Ah, I have a cell that speeds up cellular repair, so if you use that as well, it will more quickly. Sure that's not dangerous? Understood, please look at this. Zoplin cut her own hand, making it bleed. And you use it like, the, like so on the bleeding area. See, it isn't dangerous, is it? <laughs> Proving it with your own body, eh? Got it. <laughs> totally normal. Totally lady. Whispers. Mr. Policeman, Mr. Policeman. What's up? Is it okay to give Big Sister this meow? No, better not give her that. I wonder what they're talking about. Um, do you have something for me? <laughs> meow! It's nothing, Wolf! Mm, well, that's pretty suspicious. We could pretend we, did, we didn't see, but we're not doing that. Show me that, Gein. No, I can't, Wolf. Come on, please. <laughs> and his hand was... Sadness. Tears. Upset. Bad ideas. It's... Oh my god, I almost said the word fursona, and I'm like, I can't do it. I can't do it. It's Joe's fursona. Oh. The thing Big Bro Joe had, Wolf. The dog keychain he always kept in his breast pocket. <laughs> the one I gave Joe. I picked it up then, Wolf. I didn't want the kidnappers to, to take it, meow. Sorry, Wolf. Oh, he picked it! He picked it up because Wolf. Isn't that cute? He's so nice. He could have gotten the hair clip, but he didn't. He, he did well. Is it okay if I take this? You're glad, meow? Yeah. This is precious to me. Thank you, Gein. Thank goodness, meow! It's <laughs> like, is this bitch serious? I mean, he, di he didn't say not to remember Joe when Sarah was, um, awake. He basically told the player, so... Don't you look at her like that. My choice. No help in it, I guess. Jealous bitch? Oh my god, what? <laughs> Ugh! What was that all of a sudden? Hallucination, gotta ignore it, gotta ignore it. Well, we've treated Gein, so let's leave. Right. If you get hurt, please come back again. Gr who- Who faults? <laughs> who fault does she think it is? He got hurt! I roared at Sophelin with my glance. Yeah, sorry. But I was taken aback by Sophelin's timid manner. I shouldn't lash out. Yes, we should. Let's go, you two. We left the medical office behind. I was just losing my mind. Like, yes, I can be logical and level-headed, but... Fuck you. What up? Reko's glancing at me. To call me over. Kiss. Is there like a look that people do? Or is it just like the way like they tilt their head? Like come here. I wonder what it is. Um. Now. No strange. It's even night outside these windows. Yeah, that's fucked. Kata. Getting that wound healed make me. <laughs> getting that wound healed made me hungry meow. Should I ask for stuffed peppers? I hate peppers meow. That's. <laughs> Sarah, can you come with me for a sec? What is it? I found a weird place. Wanted to show you before telling everyone. Weird place. Come on, follow me. If I could do this over again, I would say that Reko would be my real voice. I don't know what, what voice I'd give Sarah, but... I don't know, my voice is like deeper, so... What is this place? Told you, weird, yeah? The most suspicious part is those stairs. There's a vending machine at the top. Vending machine. We're gonna touch it. There aren't any items displayed inside. And no price is shown either. Mm, the power's on. A vending machine with no clear merch or prices. The hell's it steal, do you think? The bill acceptor slot is plugged up. But it looks like you can put in coins. Ah. Like tokens? Yes. What should we do? Put in some tokens? H hold on a second. Let's do. 
I'll try putting some in. C cut it out. You don't gotta take the risk. Move it. <laughs> I love that. Rocco swiftly inserted a token. Oh my God, I think I got bit. Ah, like bug bite on my leg. It's like, what the fuck? Oh, sorry. It just, it felt weird. I'm sorry. <laughs> Nothing's happening. Maybe one token isn't enough. Hmm. I wonder. Seeing as there's this number above it, maybe. You have to insert 200 tokens. Huh? Who's gonna earn that many? That better be one goddamn tasty soda. Maybe there's no need to worry about it. Got a point. 200 is just unreasonable. No problem ignoring it then. Well, ain't that a relief. Let's ditch this creepy place. Oh, Recco. Hmm? I took the coin she inserted from the return slot. Oh, I took the coin she inserted from the return slot and gave it back to Recco. Hey, thanks. Now let's move, Sarah. Right. Maybe we can come back if we solve the mystery. Besides, it's about time I do an attraction. Really? I don't wanna. Let's see what we got. Show me what you got. Let's try. Hey, Alice, what's up? Moving with these handcuffs, chains, and iron ball is such a nuisance. It's stressful. Yeah, he's always wearing those. Let's tear them off! Uh, they suit you? That's mean, right? I tried, but it was no use. So he did try. Can we just... They suit you. There's no joy in that! Whoever these suit must be the worst, right? That didn't make him happy. <laughs> I want to just talk to everybody if I can. Oh my... I'm sorry. I always do that, the relaxation room and the ruined corridor. Plus, it blinks like this, so I keep thinking that's where I came from. This hallway is complicated as a maze. Fuck's sake. There's wood fragments here, too. I wonder if the weapon so got hit with was taken from here. Hey, can we rest a little? We'll hardly get any exploring done if you keep resting so much. Fucking. Okay. Three, three. We didn't go to the monitor. Rego! Seems like this floor still got plenty of hidden areas. Okay. What's up, Mishima? Oh! She said we were brave and kind. Um, he, I mean, he. Oh, now did. Um, teacher smoker, right? <laughs> We gotta ask him. We're not going to. Runaway minecart, stay on target. We can go to the prize exchange, but real quick, we can go to the medical office now. On a list of things we aren't supposed to do. Something is faintly reflected by the girl by the glass. Joe is there. Splat. Not again. It's a hallucination. I must just be hallucinating again. Hallucinations worse by 20. Oh shit, we're at 90. Uh, Sarah. Why? Why didn't you save me, Sarah? Ugh. No more. No more of this. How long can I suffer? How long am I going to? I approach the closet, but the hallucination doesn't go away. In fact, I can only see it more clearly. Don't tell me this is... Oh god. Joe. No, he's not reacting. What? What's wrong with my eyes? <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, don't go opening doors without asking, please. Sophelin? Uh. I'm so gross. <laughs> I'm like, does it vibrate? <laughs> this is mine. <laughs> Something that looks just like Joe is looking at me. I swear to God. I'm sorry if I'm, I seem creepy, but like, we've got like negative, like 90 bad right now. We're in the ne negative of 90. We're gonna lose our fucking mind. Give me this. <laughs> if you need something, please just let me know and don't go searching around on your own. What this? Thoughtful and please tell me, what in the world is this? Well, um, what 
difference in there is a doll. A doll? You must have seen them before as well. A doll of Miss Kana, a doll of yourself. Come to think of it, I do remember using a doll that looked just like me in the mirror room. Do you remember now? Yeah. <laughs> are they really dolls? What the fuck do you think? Who made them? I don't know. What are they for? So gross. What is the... <laughs> what is the purpose of these dolls? They are one of the experiments done by our organization. I cannot say anything more than that. Fuck. The more I looked at the doll, the... I felt it might start moving at any moment. It's like Joe really is there. If it pleases you, do you want to borrow it? <laughs> I told I'm disgusting. Don't be ridiculous. Who would want this thing? One of the purposes these dolls were made for is mental relief. A precious person you can no longer meet. You can talk to them or have them beside you. A doll is a doll. I don't need it. But you're distressed, aren't you? Please be honest, Miss Sarah. You need salvation. Look at her eyes. You have regrets. If you desired it, you could have joined hands with Joe and escaped together. Rude. Did we try to vote for him as a sacrifice this time? I don't remember. Fuck off. Whatever. Either way, you, you don't win. So... You gave that up and killed Joe. And you mourn that fact. If Joe had just said that he was the sacrifice, then maybe we literally could steer votes that way. Stop it! Facing Joe Tazna, that is your only path toward salvation. That's not! Stubborn, I see. Then just for you. Allow me to show you a wonderful function that will make you feel even closer to the star. I'm pretty sure the first time I played this, I'm like, that's where I said it vibrates. Quit it, you. <laughs> Isn't that a little too much interference? Maybe you're not a villain, but you're sure not normal. Who, who, okay, who said that timid means not villain? You know what I mean? I'm sure some villains just are awkward and anxious, too. I apologize, I went too far. I won't speak any more about dolls. However, if I may at least offer a suggestion, I have a device for healing mental wounds. Please, come here before your hallucinations become so intense as to destroy your mind. That is all. Well, so long. Are you okay? <laughs> we tired. I'm exhausted. Can't say I'm surprised. Wanna sit down for a bit? Romance. Come on, they're on the beach. Think about it. Even though I just was talking about this Joe doll. Forget. Sarah, did you? Did you like Joe? No, I like liked him. What the fuck is that? Um, he's just an equip- rude. Years. What a weird question to ask somebody about their dead friend. I mean, we basically just admitted that there was a girl, like another girl that he liked, Yoko. So, I don't know. He was a close friend. No one else was as foolish, soft-hearted, and cheerful as him. Yeah, I'll bet. Ooh, angry face. He was someone important to you, regardless of liking or love, right? Come to think of it, you had someone important to you too, right? You said you'd tell me about it if we survived the main game. I did. It was back when your good old policeman was still in grade school. All I had was a single mother. We weren't affluent. So when I went to my- So when I went to visit friends, I had to borrow my mom's errand bicycle. The brakes on it were busted, so one day I fell off and the bike went sailing into the river without me. The embarrassment of being laughed at by my friend and the pain of losing my mom's dear bicycle got me weeping like nobody's business. And there on the scene was the friendly neighborhood policeman. He leapt into the river and fished out the bike and even spent hours at the police box repairing it. 
soaking wet and awkwardly cool. He was my hero. So he was the person- So he was the person important to you. He's what made me want to be a policeman. I'll never forget it. It's a precious memory. Donka. I feel like I've learned something about you for the first time, KG. Huh? Oh, really? Thank you very much. Don't mention it. Okay, that's the end of that story. You calm down a little? Yes, thank you very- Oh my god, okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure if you don't say thank you, she says thank you here, but it's weird. See ya. You can always depend on Mr. Policeman. Okay, so we're gonna leave. But we're gonna come back. <laughs> yeah! It's me, Sopolin. I won't leave my post from now on. I see. Please trust me to take care of your for your binds and bodies. Speaking of which, Miss Sarah, would you like to forget a bit about the hallucinations corroding your mind? Forget. Yes, it would be bad for them to harm your mind. Please consider it while you can still recover. I can forget, Joe. I will ask you again. Miss Sarah, will you use this device to forget your hallucinations? What should I do? Let's try forgetting! <laughs> Alright, do it. Yes, don't worry, it's a very comforting device. Super comforting. Here we are. Attach this to your head. Hey, is this really okay? You're attaching all this stuff to my body. It's all right. Most of these devices are for massaging your shoulders while we're at it. My shoulders aren't, sh aren't stiff, though. Well, then, here we go. Or, here we go. Whatever you want. Ah. Ugh. Ah. 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 Pant, pant, pant. How was it? Doesn't your mind feel refreshed? Pant, pant, huh? You're right. Ah, uh, what is this? It doesn't seem real that I was suffering. My mind feels so clear. Hallucination went down to zero. Forgot about Joe a little. It's dangerous to use twice, so you shouldn't use it anymore. Right, got it. Thank you, Sophilin. It's not as if you're fully cured. Please be wary of future hallucinations. Yeah, they're, they're like, here's the reset on that. 